this here right here happened more than people think. This particular location here is off of 59 South, taking the 610 eastbound exit. Uh, in different parts of the city, we have flashing lights let truck drop know where you're going too fast because you're coming off the interstate, you know, where the speed is then is 65 or 60, coming around the curve, you know, it, it kind of creeps up over me. So I'm not taking this. It can be a lot of reasons for this. You know, your straps can be loose, you know, uh, it causes your load to shift. Do y'all remember the time that this happened, man? I think it was one time. A couple of times it was uh, alcohol. Uh, truck flipped over. It caused, you know, instead of the pipes down here, what you're seeing, man, uh, it had beer, it was Budweiser all over the place. Man, boy, you should have seen them people down here, here just grabbing that beer, man. It was... <laughs> They had to bring the police down here. See, it ain't no police down here now. Who gonna come over and grab some of this doggone pipe? There ain't nobody gonna grab this pipe, man. But let it be some alcohol. A uh, truck flip over. I think they be praying and wishing uh, uh, that uh, another alcohol, it could even be uh, soda. It don't matter, man. Anything, that any kind of beverage, they gonna be down here collecting that stuff collectively. <laughs> Uh, I don't know how they go clean this to the, this. This is right here going to be a very expensive bill. Uh, you probably, probably they probably going to be looking at close to uh, probably about twenty thousand dollars or more right here. You, you gotta you gotta bring your uh, uh, forklift out here, trailer. Uh, probably take this product somewhere to see if any can be savage. But most likely, it, it, depending on what kind of pressure is going to be on this pipe, whether if it's a sewage line, a water main, uh, this pro this load, this whole load here is probably is total. Uh, guys, just be careful, man. These curves can creep up on you. Uh, not saying that you know the driver be at fault, but most likely yes, but not because he was speeding. It, it, it can be because the load wasn't secured properly because if it's not, the load will shift on you even when you're going slow. This way you're supposed to make the big money on the flatbed because flatbed gives higher liabilities. So you shouldn't be hauling flatbed for no cheap rates. All right? So guys, be safe out there. Take your time. Be luck. Good luck to everybody.